Our newest, biggest exhibit at the Cincinnati Zoo is our African savanna. You've probably come recently. You've seen everything from painted dogs to giraffes to bat-eared foxes. But what we've been waiting for is finally here. Our hoofed animals are starting to come out. So far, we have two species out. Impala with those great horns that sort of twist out, and then Thompson's gazelles. Now, Thompson's gazelles are really petite. In fact, in Africa, sometimes people call them cheetah chips because they're the favorite food of the African cheetah. As a result, they're very, very savvy, very wary animals. Most prey animals are nervous and cautious, but they are extremely so. Now, impala are a little less that way because they live in great big herds in nature. One male will have a harem, a great big group of females that he lives with. And his safety in numbers, they're all looking in different directions and they're very worried about predators, but not as worried as if they were by themselves or in pairs. Having them out here in the savannah is really fun. When you come to the zoo, you might notice we currently have burlap up on the side. And the reason is to let animals that are brand new recognize here's where the barrier is to your exhibit. Here's the border. Now, sometimes that's just to make sure, you know, they stay safe and don't run into things. In the case of hoof stock like this, we don't want them to literally jump out. So what does that mean? Well, impala in nature are known to jump 10 feet in the air and when running a single leap of 35 feet. And though we do have barriers between them and the lions, I'll tell you what, if they really got going, the two might get mixed up and that would work out very badly, of course, for the impala. So this sets up a barrier, they get used to it and all's well. Now, if you've been wondering, you know, where have these guys been? It's true, they've been here, but they've been behind the scenes in an outdoor yard, just getting used to being here, living together, and then finally coming out. And what's fun is this fall we'll have another species, the lesser kudu. They'll come out with these guys as well. So when you come to the zoo this fall, make sure you come see our African savanna. It's right in the heart of our Africa exhibit and really a fun thing to see.